Korea is marking one of its most solemn anniversaries on this Monday. Four years ago today, on April 16, 2014, a passenger ferry called the Sewonho capsized in waters off Korea's southwestern coast, killing more than 300 people, most of whom were teenagers on a school trip. Our Kim Yo-sun has more on how that day is being remembered. Four years have passed since Korea witnessed its worst maritime disaster, which claimed the lives of 304 people, mostly high school students, on a field trip to Jeju Island. In memory of the Tewolo ferry victims, memorial ceremonies were held nationwide on Sunday. At the nation's southwestern port city of Mokpo, the ill-fated ferry lies above water and was open to the public for the first time. Marking the fourth year since the Sewolho disaster, we are sharing the pain with the families of the victims through this memorial ceremony. We hope this tragedy can become a stepping stone for a safer society. People gathered to remember the victims and the tragedy. I feel so sad looking at the ferry up close. I hope we can make a safer nation for our children. People also visited the official government memorial altar at Ansan, Gyeonggi-do province, where the government will hold a special ceremony on Monday. Some 5,000 people, including Prime Minister Lee nak and the victims' families, are expected to attend. A separate memorial service will also be held in the western port city of Incheon, where the memorial altar for non-student victims has been prepared. Kim Yo-san, Arirang News.